Hey, today we are going to continue your research about gender. You have finished your presentations in your group. In this video, we will do part five and six of our second worksheet. First, look at your first worksheet. You will use your conclusion from your first worksheet. Look at the conclusions from all your group members. Choose the best conclusion, the conclusion that is most interesting. Your group will continue that research. Look at the conclusion. In this example, the conclusion is boys use more money than girls. We will use this conclusion to make our new idea. First, we change the conclusion into a question. Why do boys use more money than girls? Then, we think of many answers to that question. Do they use their money going to movies? Or do boys buy more games and apps? Or maybe comic books? Or do they use their money on food? Then we choose our best answer and make our new idea. Boys use more money than girls because boys buy more food than girls. Write your idea on your paper like this. Boys use more money than girls because boys buy more food than girls. Making a new idea is important, so think about it carefully. If you can't make a new idea from your conclusion, please talk to a teacher in class. Now we have a new idea. Next, we need to test this idea to see if it is true. This time, we will use an interview. Interview might be a new word for you, Let's try it. Interview. Interview. An interview is like a survey. You ask people questions to get information. Survey questions are simple, but interview questions can be more complicated. We can use questions that start with words like what, why, and how. So, our new idea is boys use more money than girls because they buy more food than girls. We want to check if that idea is true. So we will ask two interview questions. How often do you buy food each week? And what do you buy with your money? We also have a follow-up question. Let's try it. Follow-up question. Follow-up question. A follow-up question is a question about the previous answer. You listen to the answer to your first question, then you ask another a question about the answer. That's your follow-up question. The follow-up question to what do you buy with your money is how much does mm, cost? So for example, you ask, what do you buy with your money? And the answer is Black Thunder. Then you ask, how much does Black Thunder cost? Before you ask other students your interview questions, you should check your questions by asking your group members before you do your interview. Some questions might be difficult to understand. If they are, change them so they're easier to understand. Like the survey, it is important to make the interview so you can check if your idea is true or not. That's all for now. We finished our group idea and we finished making our interview questions. Good job. 